All right. So before going to requirement three, there is an important definition, uh, important notion that we should uh, clear out. And so here is the definition, the concept of on the equilibrium path and off the equilibrium path. All right. So for a given equilibrium, by the way, whenever we say equilibrium, it may mean a Nash equilibrium, subgame perfect Nash equilibrium, Bayesian Nash, or perfect Bayesian Nash, right? any equilibrium. So for any given equilibrium uh, profile in a given extensive form game, an information set, all right, an information set is on the equilibrium path. If it, is, if it will be reached, with a positive probability if the game is played according to the equilibrium strategies, all right? And it is called off the equilibrium path if it is certain, probability one, not to be reached if the game is played according to the equilibrium strategies, all right? So I think it's very uh, straightforward and easy the description. Well, again, for the same example, I have one, two, three, four different examples. So let's suppose, I, we didn't check them yet, but let's suppose these are equilibrium, all right? So uh, here, player one is gonna play left with one health probability and right with one health probability, so he's mixing. Player two is gonna play U and he holds a belief mu, I don't know what it is, but some belief. In this description, Mu is irrelevant. Player two's action is also irrelevant. What is relevant is the player one's move. Why? Well, because player one is the guy who determines whether this info set will be reached or not. Remember, in this game, there are two info sets. The first info set is the initial info set. Obviously, the initial info set is not uh, I mean, you cannot say it is on the equilibrium path or off the equilibrium path, right? Because it is the initial uh, info set. So therefore, we are talking about uh, info sets other than the initial one. So here, basically, we're talking about the second player's information set. So for therefore, whether it is on or off the equilibrium path depends only on the first player's strategy, equilibrium strategy. Well, here, according to this strategy, one half L, one half R, with the positive probability, first guy is gonna play left. And so this information set, if the players play according to those strategies, with the positive probability, this information set can be reached. And hence, according to this equilibrium strategy profile, this information set is on the equilibrium path, on the equilibrium path. Okay, what about this st uh, equilibrium strategy profile? Player one is supposed to play right with probability one, and then player two plays U and belief system mu. Well, according to this equilibrium strategy profile, or forget about saying equilibrium, equilibrium, according to this strategy profile, player one is not supposed to play left or N. So therefore, the probability that this game will ever reach so this information set is zero. So therefore, this information set is off the equilibrium path. If this is the uh, equilibrium uh, strategy profile. According to this, player one is gonna play left with probability one. Therefore, this is on the equilibrium path, on the equilibrium path. And finally, three over four M, one over four R. So that means uh, according to this uh, equilibrium strategy profile, uh, this information set is also on the equilibrium path. Okay, so as simple as this. If, so, well not if, uh, let me take it back. So whether an information set is on or off the equilibrium path depends on the strategy profile, all right? And uh, so if you change the strategy profile, uh, you can you you change whether the information set is on or off the equilibrium path. All right.